My beloved child, it is I, your God, the source of boundless grace and mercy that fills your life. When darkness surrounds you, I am the light that lifts you from despair. In moments of pain, I am the comforting embrace that shelters you. Like the strength of an eagle, I renew you. I heal your wounds and feed your spirit with my everlasting words. I have unveiled a realm beyond the ordinary, empowering you to overcome the fiercest of adversities. You shall walk in safety, untouched by the perils that lurk in shadows. The message I impart today is one of peace. It clears away your uncertainties and bathes you in calmness. Be assured I am ever watchful over your eternal well-being. As the world edges toward its destined end, I understand the challenges you face each day. Temptations abound, and adversaries surround you, seeking to lead you astray. Trust can be elusive. Friends may falter, enemies may plot, and even family may turn their backs in your time of need. Yet, remember I am steadfast beside you. My love for you deepens with each passing day. Do not place your hopes solely in the hands of mortals or the fleeting treasures of this world. Today I reaffirm a promise that is as unyielding as it is profound. Throughout your journey, you are accompanied at every turn. I release you from the chains of your past, forgiving your errors and infusing you with my spirit, empowering you to move forward with renewed purpose and peace. Let this assurance settle deep within your heart as a constant reminder of my presence and grace. Those who stand against you, hoping to see your defeat, will find themselves thwarted, for their intentions will not sway the plans I have for you. Any barriers that arise on your path are subject to my oversight. They will be addressed with divine precision, ensuring that your way is made clear. The ones who desire your failure will ultimately face the consequences of their own actions, leading only to their own disappointment and shame. Hold fast to this knowledge. My support is not fleeting, but steadfast. As obstacles emerge, remember that they are not insurmountable. My power is greater than any opposition and my purpose for you is one of success and upliftment. Walk boldly in the strength I provide, trusting that no external force can deter the blessings and victory that I have ordained for your life. Trust in me wholeheartedly, take hold of the promises I have bestowed upon you, and open your heart to the full measure of my mercy. Listen attentively, allow my words to reshape your heart and renew your mind. There is an abundant life before you, rich with purpose and divine calling, meant to be lived fully under my guidance. Your truest support and enduring strength derive from my presence, not from the fleeting comforts of this world. As your eternal anchor, I provide stability in the tumult of life, and as your guide, I lead you through each phase with wisdom and foresight. Embrace this truth and let it fortify your spirit in times of uncertainty and challenge. Move forward with confidence, knowing that my love and guidance are inexhaustible sources of strength. As you navigate the complexities of life, remember that I am with you always, offering clarity and peace. Let this assurance be the cornerstone of your existence and watch as your path unfolds with grace and favor under my watchful care. My dear child, if you seek a life filled with profound blessings and transformative changes, know that I am your path. You're already on the journey, just keep moving forward. Love me wholeheartedly and make me your priority. A few moments each day with me can start a beautiful journey. Once you feel the joy of my presence, you'll find yourself longing to spend even more time in reflection and prayer. Do not squander your days, gain strength, find encouragement, 
and stand ready to claim victory over any challenges. Through my sacrifice, you have been chosen and embraced. Though you are not without flaw, my grace covers you. You are far from being lost in sin. Whenever you seek guidance, turn to my word. Open your Bible for wisdom and consult my faithful servants. I promise to aid your success. Life will never be without its trials and burdens, but trusting in me transforms your journey. I breathe life and joy into your soul and crown you with victory. I envision you in white, empowered with authority and courage to break barriers and reach afar, displaying my wonders to the world. I am preparing you to stand resilient in faith, to inspire others who are hindered by their past and underestimate the blessings I offer. My delight is to smooth your path, answer your prayers, and fortify you in your trials. I want you to grow and learn from every challenge with humility. Open your heart to me, and I'll reveal a new path adorned with my glory. On this path, the impossible becomes achievable. Hearts change, blessings flow, debts dissolve, and joy surrounds you. My love and mercy accompany you always, even in unseen moments. I am there, noticing every tear and every smile ever present in your life. In your moments of darkness, remember, I am your light. When you feel weak, I am your strength. When confusion clouds your mind, I am here to guide you. Trust in me. You've sought a message that resonates deeply. So, let us address those hidden corners of your heart. Those you think remain unseen. But I see all. We need to have a conversation, you and I. This is why I urge you each morning to not rush into the day's distractions or worries. Start with gratitude. For your life, your family. Recognize that you still have time to make amends. My love for you is boundless, and my mercy towards you is deep and enduring. I have chosen not to treat you as your errors deserve, nor have I turned my back on you for past mistakes, whether they involve dishonesty, deceit, or betrayal. Each sin carries weight and significance. None is trivial in my sight. Yet my response is not one of harsh judgment, but of compassion and forgiveness. This grace I offer you is not a license to continue in wrongdoing, but an invitation to transformation. It's an opportunity to learn from your missteps and to grow stronger in character and faith. My forgiveness is a testament to my unending love for you, designed to empower you to leave behind the ways that lead to pain and embrace a life filled with integrity and truth. Therefore, embrace this mercy with a humble and grateful heart. Let it inspire you to pursue a path of righteousness, knowing that I am with you, guiding and supporting you every step of the way. Let my love be the cornerstone of your life, influencing not just your actions, but also how you interact with others. In this way, the mercy you have received can be reflected in your dealings with others, spreading the grace and forgiveness that has been so freely given to you. Sins like adultery and fornication can ravage your body and spirit, but so can slander, lies, pride, and discrimination. These two inflict pain and can tear families apart. If you feel moved by these words, if you sense my Holy Spirit stirring within, commit to seeking me more earnestly. Engage with my word, follow my commands, and trust in my presence. Today, take a step closer. Find a confidant to share your burdens with. In doing so, you will break free from your chains of guilt and anxiety. Starting now, Nothing will hinder the blessings and the peaceful future I have planned for you. Today I want to remind you of my deep love for you. There's someone else in your life who needs to hear these words, 
Please share them. I cherish you wholeheartedly. Good morning, and thank you for taking the time to listen. These words are meant to bring you peace. Read them again, slowly and attentively. Feel my presence next to you, comforting and calming your weary heart. Remember, you are never alone. With me by your side, no harm will come your way. Take a moment to calm yourself. Close your eyes. Let the tears stop. Each tear you shed tells me of your needs, and my voice is here to heal and comfort you, lifting the weight of anxiety. My love envelops you, dries your tears and wraps you in peace. Don't rush away. Linger here a while longer. I want you to leave this place fortified, ready to walk through life's challenges without fear, knowing you're cradled in my eternal love. Feel my love. Embrace it. Believe in it. My Holy Spirit is here, enveloping you with care and protecting you from harm. Life will challenge you, but with your faith in my word, you understand your strength. You possess a rock-solid belief that you will prevail. Today marks the end of many years of pain. I will clear your heart of any bitterness, sorrow, guilt, and regret. These burdens will fade from your memory. You are incredibly precious to me. If only you could fully grasp this, your joy would be complete. I will instill this assurance in your heart, and no one will be able to shake your faith. Each day, make it a practice to count your blessings. Be thankful for the air you breathe for life, for your loved ones, for your sustenance. Look closely and you'll find countless reasons to be grateful. Seek these blessings with patience and soon you'll appreciate even the smallest of them. Raise your hands to the heavens and give thanks for this moment and your place in it, for every day brings new reasons to live and strive. Remember. The choice to be happy or sad is yours. Do not let others sow doubts or take away your joy. Your help comes from me, your eternal God. Blessings will rain down like living water, rejuvenating your body, energizing your mind, filling your soul with peace, your mouth with laughter, and your vision with dreams of things soon to unfold. Learn daily from my teachings. Come and listen attentively. Open your Bible and truly immerse yourself in its truths. My Holy Spirit will guide you, revealing the path of righteousness. Beware of those who claim to deliver groundbreaking revelations or who attempt to manipulate your faith with false prophecies and threats. If ever in doubt, pray. My spirit will comfort and reassure you, reminding you of my protective embrace. Affirm it aloud. My heavenly Father is with me. No adversary can overpower me. Be mindful of your words, refraining from slander or spreading falsehoods. Speak kindly of those who support and serve you faithfully. If you falter, approach me. I am here to forgive and purify your heart. Seek me in prayer each morning. I am eager to relieve you of guilt and regret. My sacrifice on the cross and my resurrection were for your liberation from every mental and spiritual affliction. Human as you are, weariness of body, soul, and mind is inevitable. Even my most devout followers experienced exhaustion and erred. Yet, they confessed their sins and return to the altar of forgiveness, ready to face their battles anew. Come to me now if you feel weary or believe you have failed. Whether it's words spoken in haste that harmed a loved one or struggles with harmful habits, if you love me and trust in my desire to assist you, approach me. I will touch your lips, cleanse your heart, and grant you forgiveness. Strive not to revisit past mistakes. 
I am here to renew your spirit and motivate you anew. Rise as a champion, leaving behind guilt and sorrow. Instead, recall the joyful times and your past victories. Just as you have triumphed before through faith, so too will you prevail again with this tender embrace I offer. Be courageous and resolute in life, for I am with you. I love you, my champion. Exercise patience with the unfolding events in your life. Remember, I'm always by your side, honoring your faith. All things occur for a reason, and while you may not comprehend it now, when you finally reach the blessings I have in store, you will understand the importance of belief, trust, patience, and perseverance. You have already received much by enduring, and more blessings are on their way. I know your love for me is rooted in who I am, not what I provide. Continue to hold me foremost in your heart, believing in my promises, regardless of the challenges you encounter. Rest assured, I will never allow you to face defeat or disgrace. Select your companions wisely, aligning yourself with those who uplift rather than undermine your spirit. Avoid letting the voices of doubt or negativity influence your heart's direction. Be assured, the difficulties you encounter today are temporary, merely transient shadows on the path I have laid out for you. At the precise time, I will step in to bring resolution and clarity. I see the weight of your struggles and the toll they take on your faith. Do not lose heart. Stand firm amid these trials, for they are refining your spirit, preparing you for the great things I have in store. Soon, I will illuminate the way forward, revealing the steps that lead to profound blessings. This path is designed uniquely for you, crafted to harness your strengths and cater to your divine purpose. Let this assurance sustain you. My timing is impeccable and my plans for you are filled with hope and prosperity. Hold on to this promise as you navigate through current adversities. Trust in my unending support and guidance, for I am with you at every step, guiding you towards a future where my blessings flow abundantly. Though it's difficult to wait, and there may seem like countless reasons to surrender, I urge you to maintain your faith. The trials you endure today are forging your strength, and no one can take away the blessings that are awaiting you. Do not surrender, my child. Continue to wait with patience and trust in me, your God. I'm preparing a future filled with blessings, peace, joy, and honor for you. Can you hold on a little longer? Tell me you will. I love you deeply. I am intimately familiar with your heart. Nothing is hidden from me. You can always approach me with confidence, wherever and whenever. Share your burdens and express your feelings, for I already understand them. Remember, how could you not be important to me when I have saved you and given you a new life? You cannot expect true love or understanding from the world, but in my presence, you have everything needed to satisfy your longing for peace and envelop your life with love, offering the profound joy that comes from feeling truly cherished. My love for you is constant, even if you have doubted during tough times. Cease placing your trust in those who betray you. Stop giving your love to those who do not appreciate it. Do not prioritize those who have made you weep. They are not deserving of such a place in your heart. That place is reserved for me. Recognize me, honor me, and offer me the reverence I deserve. In your life, I should be your God, your Lord, your King, and no one else should take that place. Your recent unease stems from allowing another to usurp my position leaving a void in your heart that only my love can fill. This is why you feel sadness, why tears come to you at night. You seek love, but you look in the wrong places. 
Come to me for peace, love, and rest. What are you waiting for? Do you wish to continue suffering at the hands of those who cause you pain, only to return to me in tears? I will welcome you even then, for my love transcends your mistakes and poor choices. But you need not wait to experience such pain. Come now, I am ready to embrace you with love and show you the depth of my affection. Come today, I am here, waiting to assist you. Even before you ask, I am ready to listen. Contemplate the depth of my love for you and my eagerness to free you from the burdens you carry. As you approach me, you do so with the understanding that I am ready to uplift you, heal your wounds, enable you to let go of past grievances, and reinstate the joys you once knew. Recognize how much I value and admire you. The bravery you display during difficult times fills me with pride, and it is my earnest desire for you to continue in your faith and trust in me, your unyielding and powerful God. Stay away from those who ridicule your faith or try to diminish your spirit. Such individuals are not genuine friends, but are people who have strayed from their faith, driven by jealousy over the blessings that are rightfully yours. Their skepticism and negativity do not reflect on your worth, but rather on their own internal struggles and lack of faith. Let your heart be fortified by my assurance and support. Remember, in every challenge, I am your refuge and strength, an ever-present help. Embrace this truth and let it anchor you. As you walk forward, do so with the confidence that comes from knowing I am by your side, guiding and watching over you. Let my love and commitment to you be the shield that protects you from the doubts and negativity that others may project. Do not waste your efforts trying to convince them or seek their approval. I will clear your path of those who seek to harm you and surround you with people who genuinely care for you. Cast aside despair, refuse to entertain worries and shut out any thoughts that disrupt your peace. Guard your mind with the helmet of faith, shield your heart with the breastplate of righteousness and wield the sword of my holy word. Prepare for a battle you're destined to win. You will not face defeat. Should you falter, I will be there to lift you. Stand ready to combat discouragement and fear. Declare your belief in me and your readiness to overcome. I will bless your home, heal your body, mind, and emotional wounds, and improve your family dynamics. Witness my power firsthand. I love you. And I want you to embrace this truth with simplicity and sincerity. Each morning, come and draw strength from my word to fuel your faith and burn away all fears that block your way. You must not let imagined fears deter you from entering your promised land. You cannot harvest the fruits of victory without taking a bold step of faith and trusting me with your abilities, struggles, and failures. At this point in your life, there's no time for doubt regarding the blessings I have in store for you. Remember, your foes were defeated at the cross, where I took upon myself the punishment for your sins. Your debt is paid. You owe nothing more. You are seated with me in the heavenly realms, already anointed with the richness of my grace. I am your Father and I have bestowed upon you your portion of the heavenly inheritance. Look in the mirror. You are not a weak creature doomed to failure, subjected to emotional torment that denies you your right to triumph. I proclaim a true and tangible victory. Freedom from debt, financial recovery, forgiveness, and harmony in your home, infused with wisdom, and prudence in your spirit and mind. A divine peace to guide your journey. Independent of others' opinions, I command you to break free from the shackles of negativity cast by those who envy you and seek to derail the blessings I have destined for you. Embrace a firm belief in my promises, lean on my word, 
and distance yourself from harmful influences. Victory is found in my presence where every morning I offer you strength, joy, and peace. I am here waiting to fill your ears with whispers of love and affection to fortify you with great strength and happiness. I am actively blessing your life and your home. Do you believe it? Receive these blessings and your love for me will deepen each day. Come, my child. Today marks the beginning of a new day filled with immense blessings. Remember, I am your shepherd. You will want for nothing. I am your provider, soon delivering all that you need. I am your healer, enveloping you in my love and granting healing. I am your protector. Beneath the shadow of my wings, you will find safety. My word is steadfast. My promises are sure. Everything I have promised will come to fruition because I am God and I do not lie. Even during your darkest moments, when you felt your sins might have separated us, and when others turned away, criticizing, hurting, and underestimating you, I was there. You felt overwhelmed, near defeat. But I, as always, approached you with understanding, grace, love, forgiveness, and tenderness, lifting you from despair. Do not doubt or falter. Declare your trust in me regardless of what challenges may come. You will triumph on every path, forever victorious. I love you deeply. If I did not abandon you in your past struggles, I will not forsake you now. I have been with you through both joy and affliction, never rejecting or forgetting you. Stand firm. If your faith ever wavers, loudly recount the promises I have made. Inform those who trouble you that I am with you always to the very end. Depend solely on my grace. Do not ponder whether you are worthy of such blessings. If you trust in my word, accept the blessings I bestow. As you take hold of them, they will multiply into greater gifts and beautiful rewards, providing all you need to enrich your family and aid those in need. You will enjoy an abundance of provisions, health, strength, and peace. But you must activate your faith and claim these blessings. Cease your doubts. Step forward confidently and do not retreat into shadows away from my presence. I'm reaching out to you now with a purpose, to hear your prayers and to lift the burdens of curse and illness from you and your loved ones. When I remove something from your life, it's only to replace it with something greater. You are at a pivotal moment, stronger and more prepared than ever before. Make your decisions with assurance and ignore the voices of those who harbor negativity. Do not strive to please those who do not wish to see you blessed. When you share your plans, they may attempt to dissuade you, pulling you back to a place of defeat. However, this will not happen, for I am with you. You will progress uh, without hindrance, and when it's time, the doors will open before you. Your faith will be the key, and I will walk through these doors alongside you. The troubles that once overwhelmed you will be left behind. I will place in your hands incredible blessings, but it's your responsibility to manage them wisely so they may grow and lay the groundwork for even greater things. As these blessings flourish, you and your family will make significant strides toward a promising future. Encourage your children toward education and inspire them to dream big. They are capable of serving me through their talents and intellect, potentially transforming families and nations. Your home is nurturing the leaders and heroes of tomorrow, who will play instrumental roles in spreading my word before my return. Your daily life should reflect your faith. Do not justify a poor disposition by claiming it is unchangeable. Nothing is beyond my power. I can soften the hardest hearts. Those who once spoke in anger will soon laugh with the innocence of children. I will transform the speech of those 
who have spoken against me, turning their harsh words into expressions as sweet as honey. This transformation within you will demonstrate my power to your family. Even if the world challenges their faith, claiming that I am powerless or non-existent, trust that my glory will be evident in your home. Your neighbors will witness a divine radiance emanating from your residence, and angels will illuminate every corner. Your home will become a site of awe-inspiring supernatural events. Many will come to you, and through your prayers I will heal the sick, resolve their troubles, and mend their wounds. Your home will be a beacon of my miraculous power, drawing those in need of my healing touch. A deep spiritual renewal is taking place within your family, a revival marked not only by outward expressions, but by inward transformations. As we navigate these crucial times, curiosity about the end times and my return abounds. Yet, true knowledge and understanding are granted to those whose hearts earnestly seek me, not merely out of curiosity, but from a place of genuine faith and devotion. My deepest revelations and the fullness of my love are disclosed to those who approach me with sincerity and integrity, who entrust their very souls to my keeping. These individuals do not just hear my words, they live them. They are the ones who carry the torch of my message, lighting the way for others, not for personal glory, but from a profound love for their fellow man. Their lives become beacons of hope and truth in a world often darkened by deceit and indifference. In your family, this revival is not just a series of events, but a transformational journey where each member is called to a higher purpose, aligned with divine will and dedicated to the greater good. Let this revival spread from your heart to your actions, from your home to the world beyond. As you each commit to upholding my word and embracing the mission to spread love and truth, you will see the power of my spirit move in ways you have never imagined. The revival in your family will become a testament to what happens when hearts united in genuine faith reach out in love. This is the essence of the spiritual awakening unfolding among you. A call to deeper faith. A call to live out the truth with courage and unwavering commitment. Today I am planting a powerful word within you. Take note of where you are and the exact moment you hear this message. Stand and gaze toward the horizon. Your life is destined to extend my glory to distant lands. In foreign places, where unfamiliar languages fill the air, my Holy Spirit will work through you and your family, sparking a spiritual revolution. Since the beginning of your journey, I have guided you, so fear not as you walk through shadowed valleys. Despite the conflicts visible to your eyes and the trials you face now, trust wholeheartedly in my word. This year, you will receive blessings, prosperity, recognition, and respect. Persevere in your faith in the one who sacrificed his life for your victory. Even if you feel unworthy or doubt your deservingness, cling to my love and forgiveness. I have chosen you to be a blessing to your family. Cast aside thoughts of defeat. I am with you in all things. Seek strength from me daily. Dismiss discouraging words and believe courageously. Feed on my word and be empowered. Live with divine strength, adorned with humility and patience, and witness blessings beyond your imagination. Embrace your triumphs with simplicity, humility, and wisdom. Remember, your victories and strength were secured through sacrifice, suffering, the shedding of blood on the cross, where your future and forgiveness were sealed. Now, receive the majestic glory afforded by my resurrection. My commitment to you is unwavering, 
unchangeable.